so good. Hello everybody, welcome here back to my channel. My name is Carly, if you guys are new. Um, I have some new faces here, so I just wanted to introduce myself. Um, oh, my tangerine juice is so good. It's making my mouth water. Oh. Yeah, I'm really, really excited for today's video. This is a video that I've literally been dreaming about doing for the past couple of days, and I don't wanna get you guys too excited. I think it's gonna be a great video, but I've just been dreaming about repotting my plants and oh, my fridge is so loud. I have been growing my plants and they have been thriving and just like growing up so beautifully that they have outgrown their current pots. And so I've never repotted plants. Um, so I thought I would just do that today and show you guys. So if this is something you'd enjoy, if you love plants and just day in the life videos and just like, nice normal people vlogs then subscribe to my channel because i do a lot of this on my channel and i'd love to have you here along for the journey my battery's gonna die so i'll see you really soon <laughs> okay we're back now and my camera is fully charged and we're about to go to the store i thought i would show you just kind of what i have right now and um how many pots i need to have um that sort of thing so i'll just show you the collection boop 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 <laughs> you're trying to be i know bye babe Bye. When you get home, say bye to these babies that I've been growing. Are you going to put them somewhere else? No, just in new pots. Okay, so this is what we have going on. So this is currently sitting in this plant here. If you guys saw my homeware haul when we first moved in here, I found this like really cute upside down little rainbow one. Um, I don't really, I'm going to have to put down below what these plants are called because I have to do some digging because I honestly do not remember but this one has just been thriving it has a couple ones that I could probably prune off but they're just like growing so much like he's new all of those down there are new like it's just insane this one's a little ripped but anyway so I need to get um I'm not really sure like who's gonna go where but I know that I have this pot to use and then I have this one here that Sebastian got me when I hit I think 500 subscribers so a while ago and it's just in this little tin, but as you guys can see, like this is just sprouting out of its little thing, like over this way too. <laughs> he just wants to move around and have a new home. So um, I need to get a new pot for this one. And then this is my snake plant, which when I got this, it was only these two. And this guy has grown completely and I'm getting a little nervous because he's kind of all the way over here and it's sitting in a mug. <laughs> so I definitely want to repot this because we've had such great growth. Like. I can't even believe it. So I need a pot for him. And then this one is currently sitting. This used to be a candle, which was like a gorgeous candle. Um, and I like this. I think I'm going to run it through the dishwasher and keep like um, my makeup brushes in it. So I'm still going to keep it, but I obviously don't want it for my plants. Um, and this one, he's usually better than he is right now. He's having a hard time because when we went on vacation, I forgot to open the windows. And so he's a little droopy, but... Um, this one always does really well. This is the first plant that I ever got. I don't really know what it is, but it's always doing, it's like when it's normally has a lot of water, it like springs up like this. It's really cute, but yeah, it's a little sad. Um, so we need one for that. And then this is the other pot that I already have. This plant is pretty new. It's when I got my fiddle leaf fig, which we all know is not doing fantastic. But anyway, I got this one the same time and it's so pretty because of the leaves. I just love like the green and the pink. It's so pretty and it's doing such a great job. It loves its little life. Um, this is a new, oh, this is a little new leaf here. I think there's one right here. You guys can see it's just like so fun to watch them grow. Anyway, um, so I have this little pot here, which I might put like one of the little ones in. I don't know. We will see what we can find, but yeah, I just have a couple, so not a lot. Um, but I'm really proud of, like I said, my little plants and their growth and the fiddly fig. Um, I'm not going to worry about it right now. I don't know what to do with it. I watched this like 16 minute video of how to take, like take care of them. And I pretty much screwed it up right when it like got here because I moved it around like every single day I would take it up and down for videos and stuff and I guess that that like traumatizes them and he was supposed to stay in one spot and I didn't leave him there anyway it's done and over with but I have like a gorgeous pot for it which I think this is so stunning so when it's time to like 
I don't know, call it quits. I might just put something else in here, but for now, it's gonna be here, it's gonna be okay. We are gonna grab our shoes and we will be out the door. Okay, so great news. I was on my way to Lowe's when I remembered that they have a DI right across the street. And although the DI isn't like my top pick for thrift stores, um, it's still like a thrift store and you always can find like really cute things to put your plants in and pots and baskets and whatever. So I thought I would go here before I go to Lowe's um, just to see if there's anything. Um, Cause yeah, I wanna find some pots but I don't wanna have to like buy them brand new if I don't have to. So, and Lowe's is literally right across the street. So we'll go in here and see what we can find. Okay, that was a little disastrous, but it didn't really take long. They had a ton of like faces and stuff, but not a ton of shallower pots. So I'm glad I checked, but we're just gonna run over to Lowe's and I think we'll have better luck there. Or I might just like all together have to maybe stop into like a Target. I don't know. We'll see what they have at Lowe's. Um, but yeah, the DI wasn't anything I was like loving. So, huh, next stop. Feel like I'm gonna need a basket. Okay, I think this is what I'm needing. Grows plants. I'm lost here. Okay, so based off of this, I need an indoor potting, which conveniently they're out of. Lowe's was completely out of their indoor potting mix because everyone's trying to repot, I guess. I guess it's the time um, or in a couple months. So anyway, I'm gonna cross my fingers, jump across the highway and see if Lowe's, no, I was just at Lowe's, I'm confused. If Home Depot has anything. <laughs> This better be worth it. And back home, I'll show you what I got. Um, you guys saw the disaster at, where did I go first? Oh, at Lowe's. But I ended up getting this gorgeous pot. I think I'm gonna put this one in this one. I just feel like it'll be the prettiest down here in the living room. So. A really big pot which I love and then popped over to uh, Home Depot I can't remember the names and was able to find the big um, mix plant mix I don't know potting mix this stuff was only like five dollars for some reason I thought it was gonna be so expensive to do this but it really wasn't and then I had to go into Walmart because um, Home Depot didn't have any plants or little pots and I really wanted to finish the project today You guys know like when I want to do something or want something like I need it immediately as it comes into my head Or I won't sleep like a couple nights ago. So I went to Harmon's right across the street. Just <laughs> Harmon's why? What is wrong with me? I went into Walmart across the street and just wanted to see if they had any like cute cheapo ones so I found this little one, which is still kind of little, but for this guy, that's only like one little thing. I think it'll be okay in there. Um, so I got that, and then the last one, I actually really loved this one, but it's um, like this gorgeous concrete gray, which I think is so cool, because one of these plants does go into Sebastian's office, so um, do I have enough? Do I have enough pots? Yeah, okay, sorry, <laughs> I'm getting distracted. And then I did do um, a little shopping at Walmart for some beauty stuff, which I know was not the theme of this video, but I thought I'd show you. Look at how cute these Eco Tools. Um, I love their beauty blender. I have the green one, but I really want these pink ones. So I grabbed a couple because who knows how long they'll be around, and I love the pink. And I got this hair mask. This is from Main Club, and this is Babe Alert. It's just like a soothing hair mask. I've been very into my hair care, so I thought I'd give that a try. And then I'm out of my way dry shampoo, which I do love, but it'll be a minute before I'm over in like the area that Ulta's at, so I figure I could just pick something up. So this is the CoLab dry shampoo in the Dreamer 
scent and it smells really good which is why I picked it up I don't know how it works we'll see tomorrow but anyway that's what I picked up so let's get to potting we're all set up so I think I'm just gonna go for it I'm gonna take off my rings because I don't want it to get dirty I wanted to buy little gloves but I sort of forgot so we'll just do without them That it can drain. Oh my gosh. I knew I was missing something. <laughs> So I finished putting them all in the pots like you guys saw, forgot some stones. So I'm just gonna like plop some in there tomorrow. I don't know if it's gonna be okay, but I'm too lazy, I just wanted to get them in. So we'll see how they do. But I put Sebastian's plants back into his office and they look so cute. So here is this one. It's always been in this pot, so it might not look a little bit different, but now he's in there and has room to grow. And I just think, oh, with the light, it's so pretty, but I think it really looks pretty up there. And then I put a little bit of color in here with this pink one. This, this guy is actually out of control. Like, <laughs> he needs to have a little bit of growth over here, but um, I'm hoping by facing him this way, It'll give him some light and yeah I think he looks so cool down there and then I plopped some into my office um, this one I've always had in here I switched him over here he was on my um, little desk but I switched him over here and I'm hoping that he can get all of the light and water that he needs to like <laughs> spruce back up but so I just sat him here and my laptop goes right here so I think it'll be nice to have a little bit of something right there and then I put my snake plant which I might need to move because I'm not really sure how he's gonna like all of the light I can't remember but I'll have to research but it was hard to see I put him in the concrete one which I think is so cute oh maybe I know that this one does okay in the sun so maybe I'll put this one back here I don't know I just really do not want anything to happen to my snake plant I like that I'm just gonna rearrange I feel like I want to take that stand away and just have my laptop be right here I don't know anyway those are plants I will run downstairs and show you guys the last one before my camera dies again. And here is the last one, and this is actually Sebastian's favorite pot. So it's the one I got at Lowe's, and it's so pretty. I think it looks so good right here in our living room. So that is everything completed. All of the plants are in their home, and hopefully they thrive here and they're happy. Um, thanks for following along with me today. Sorry, I ran up the stairs to finish this, and now I'm out of breath. But I hope that you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, give it a huge thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you in my next video. Bye!